Hi, I'm Stephanie from Renovation Baby and today I wanted to show you how I've added some artificial plants into our utility room. And the reason why I did this was because when we created our utility room, um, I put real plants in here, didn't like it, they didn't survive or I had to move them because as you see above, this utility room is only lit with a sun tunnel so it hasn't got any proper sort of sunlight in here. So I thought after we had installed these units above the toilet area over here I felt like it needed something to kind of break up that space but they're the big sort of white units so I thought it'd be really good to add in some artificial plants here because I liked having the plants here but they just didn't survive in this room. So I've worked with Blooming Artificial which is an online store full of artificial plants for your inside and outside. I was sent the Monstera bundle which includes three plants at £115.38 and free delivery over £75. So they came really well packaged, nice and secure, there's got packaging all around the actual plant and then this one was strapped in like this to keep it nice and secure so I was very impressed with how they came. And then the other two plants they came in their separate box in a different box with all the pots that were included with this bundle as well. So it had this label on it which says do not remove the orange or brown wire and there's also this one here which you can see the orange brown but there are also little black cable ties but I ended up actually cutting those. Um, I'm not sure if I was meant to or not because they were really really super tight however it just didn't mean that the large plant was going to sort of stand well so I cut them. <laughs> so this is the cheese plant it measures 120 centimeters high and it comes with this 25 centimeter white pot so it's got like this little artificial moss on there as well and yeah you've got to give it a chance to sort of fluff out and spread out and sort of you move them around and stuff like that but the really large leaves then it comes with the monstera elbow which is 47 40 centimeters sorry and it comes with a 14 centimeter pot um i decided to put it in this pot that i had this pink pot because i felt it went better with my utility room but this is the pot that it came in so a really nice clean simple blue pot the next plant that came in the bundle is a hanging monkey monster and it's 80 centimeters long and i've placed it in this corner and then i've spread out some of them to go one way and i've spread out the other ones to hang down um, I've used a bit of blue tack in places to sort of hold the hanging net bits in the areas that it needed to be um, to keep it in place but they're really really sturdy so it was quite tricky to sort of get them placed where you wanted them um, but I really like that I can see them through the glass shower so that it got rid of that white block of the kitchen or of the units I call them kitchen units because that's what they were um, and so yeah, I think it really breaked it up. So when you can stand back and see the room as a whole, it just breaks up this plain wall that we've got down the other end, sort of down below. I actually really like having these artificial plants in here because they're just so durable, low maintenance, and I can just give them a dust off um, and keep them clean. So yes, I'm really pleased. Um, I hope you like it too. If you want to head over to my blog post, you can have a look at more information about the products I used and find the links where you can purchase them yourself. Thank you very much for watching. Bye bye.